All right, welcome to Omni's Eat. My name is John. And I'm Jessica. And today we are unboxing the Keto Box. Or the Keto Box, depending on your pronunciation. I uh, did already cut this box you, open yes, before you, we started the camera. Cheat it. I just cut the box open. Oh, you cheated. Okay. How much is this box a month? $40. Better, I don't know. All right, very good. So we got this. That's what it looks like. That's what it looks like. Okay. All right. And then uh, it does have some cards in here, yeah, so I'm gonna pull the cards out. Ooh, we got a buy one get one golden cauliflower crust pizza. Yes. We got a coupon last month for just a free one, not buy one get one, and we already redeemed it. We haven't tried the pizza yet, but we have redeemed the coupon for a free pizza. So pizza. Can come in here. I'm in as far as I can get, baby. <laughs> All right. All right. You want to go ahead and pull something out? <sighs> The Keto Box does come with a card with all of the items on it, so mm. it's a little bit different <gasps> than the Keto Crate. Anyway, that's also something I like. <laughs> okay. Huevos made from egg whites, sour cream and onion flavor. Oh, I'm not going to like this. Nobody is going to like this. I don't like sour cream and onion flavor. All right. Serving size is a bag, about 35 crisps, chips. Calories are 140, eight fat, nine carbohydrates. Wow. Oh. Minus six fiber and one sugar. So it's three, three, net, three, net, three net, carbs. net carbs. Yeah. Ten grams of protein. Um But they're right. chips made from egg whites. Yep. I don't like sour cream and onion, right? Sour cream no. and onion flavor. No. I don't like sour cream and onion. Uh, and I, I would love to try these, but I don't like sour cream and onion, so I wouldn't be able to give a very good assessment. Are you are you interested in opening these? I am not. The one person that does like sour cream Neil. flavored chips is Neil, yeah. and he is not home right now. Otherwise, we would drag him in here and tell you what it is. So um, we're not going to open that because we don't like them. But Neil will try them, and I will try to leave down in the description bar down below what Neil thought Some of feedback. the yeah the sour cream and onion flavored huevos. All right. All right. Is it my turn? No, I'm just going to keep pulling stuff out because I like doing it. Ooh, L M N T element. 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 Yeah. Recharge. Electrolyte drink mix. Three sticks. Three stick pack. It's a okay. sample pack. Okay. So, back by science. It has no real listing of the ingredients. It just says uh, 1,000 milligrams of sodium. This is the ingredients. Sodium, potassium, potassium magnesium. magnesium. That's the ingredients. Yeah, but it doesn't say what flavors there are. Well, open da -da 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 -da. Wow. It must be... Here, you do it. You're gonna, okay. gonna rip it. There is a like zipper pouch. Yeah, I'm worried that there's like like a bunch of loose powder in there. I hope not, because it said it's, it said three pouches, didn't it, on the front? It did. But you know, packaging couldn't lie. There are three pouches in here. They're all. They're all. Oh, citrus cit salt is the flavor. So like a probably a lemonade flavorish. Sure. Something like that. Three pouches. So that's pretty cool. Wait, we're not going to yeah, try not... them out right now. So, no. so far we're 0 for 2. All right. Is it my turn yet? You one turn? Is that what it is? Go ahead. You have a turn. All right. I'm going to pull this out. This is the Curly Girls Candy Chocolate Caramels. We are not going to open this. What? Because we literally just finished filming the Keto Crate unboxing. <gasps> um, and we just tried these. Mm-hmm. Uh, the exact same product, literally the exact, the exact mm. same packaging, everything. I would go grab it out of the keto crate, except it's outside of uh, my arm's reach. So, mm. um, w it wasn't bad. Mm. I don't think it was our favorite, either one of ours favorite, but right. it wasn't bad. So yeah, I probably would not buy this flavor again. We have made a purchase from Curly Girls Candy before, right. but I would probably not buy this flavor again. <laughs> so we're over three now. Over three. Your turn. All right, I am going to pull this out because I want to taste it. I knew you were going to pull that out. This is Virgil's uh, Zero Sugar Vanilla Cream. It's a, it's a cream soda. It's a cream soda. Uh, zero, zero calories, zero fat, 18 carbohydrates. But 18, it's all erythritol. It's all erythritol. All right, let's do it. Let's hope no one shook this up. We've tried Virgil's before. We have. We've we've gotten uh, their cola flavor, I believe. I think. We have. Yeah. It's not a fan. It was not our favorite. 
So. Are you going to try it? Uh, I'm not a big fan of cream soda. Taste it. It tastes like, I think it tastes like caramel. I think it tastes like cream soda. I think you're nuts. Although it's not terrible. It was, it's not terrible. It'd probably taste better cold. No. I'm going to pull this out. This is. Another drink mix. A drink mix. I thought it might be something else. I thought it might be like some sort of treat because all I saw was that it was raspberry cheesecake flavor. This is keto chow, right? Is that what this is called? <sighs> yeah, keto chow. That's how I read it. It's the raspberry cheesecake ultra low carbohydrate meal replacement shake mix. Interesting. That is what it looks like. That's a lot of mix. It is. And it's one serving is, is the pouch. It said it's a meal replacement, though, right? Yeah. Um, that's odd. Okay, so this is this is a little bit different. Uh, add a fat source, oil or heavy cream, and it, and it says go to the website to see how much to use. Add the full packet of powder. Add 14 ounces of water. Mix until all the powder is wet and stick it in your fridge for at least 30 minutes, though overnight is preferred. So, it's got the... One scoop dry mix information, a quarter cup of avocado oil or a half cup of heavy cream in like the, the nutrition information. I'm just going to read the, the powder. 120 calories. Fat is 0.3 grams. Carbs is 7.23 grams with 6.77 dietary fiber. So about a half a gram of carbs and 25.71 grams of protein. So it's very high in protein. Not bad as far as carbs go, and uh, very low in fat, which is probably why it says to add the fat source, either right. the avocado it... oil or the heavy cream. So, yeah, to make it keto. Yeah. So, okie dokie. I'm not going to eat that. John probably will be the one that ends up eating uh, that. I don't Maybe know. Maybe not. That. You're not a big sweet, sweet fan. So. No, ma'am. All right. Not. You going to grab something? I am. Oh, wow. Okay. This is cacao coconut. Coconut, almond, macadamia nut butter, super fuel to support metabolism and brain functions. I probably should eat this. All right. I'm out, well, one serving size is one pouch. It's vegan, keto, and paleo. Whew. Okay. Total fat, 22 grams. Wow. That's some stuff right there. Uh, total carbs, 12 grams. Minus six dietary fiber... Minus three sugar alcohol. Hmm. So that's three net carbs. There you go. And then five grams of protein, which is not a lot. Yeah. How much? What, what's the ingredients? Coconut butter, almonds, erythritol, cacao powder, macadamia nuts, cinnamon, pink Himalayan salt, and stevia. Okay. So, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. Are we going to open it? I'll open it. I'm going to massage it a little bit here. Yeah, massage it? Yeah. Rub Let's it, see if it. we can... Because it definitely, like, the bottom of the pouch definitely feels Seems like hard. it's... Yeah. 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 Like, there's definitely some nut butter stuck, stuck in the down. bottom of the pouch, yeah. Yeah, I don't really... Like, that packaging, Yeah. although I think is really nice, I guess, for, like... If you're gonna like take it on the go, yeah, this would be nice if you're going on like a road trip or something, or, like hiking or yeah, hiking, or whatever you're gonna do. It, it actually even has like, hold on, let me see some. Can you like punch these out? Yeah, I don't know, maybe. It almost looks like there's a way to punch a hole in there. I don't think so. All right, no, well, sorry. Right. We're gonna open this up and give it a try. Watch out! The last time you did something like this, we ended up with butter everywhere. Nobody wants that. Nobody's in. Oh, that's very oily. Go ahead, squirt some of that in your mouth. What's this? That's it. Hmm. Wow. That was. <clears throat> I just got an awful oil. I think it's pretty good. It's definitely not terrible. Hmm. That is good. <clears throat> I don't think it's overpowering like cocoa. No. And I don't think it's overpoweringly, overpoweringly coconut. No, but you can get it there. You can taste the coconut. You can get there. That's good. Yeah. I really like that. And there's almost like a hint of cinnamon. Yeah, it said cinnamon. Oh. I remember those ingredients. I wasn't paying attention. No, you weren't. 
I don't know what you were doing. I think I, I could taste the cinnamon too. I think it tastes good. 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 All right. What good. do I want to pick out next? You're digging. I think I'm going to pull this out right here. This is Creation Nation No Bake Energy Bite Mix. So we're not going to taste this because it's a mix. It's a mix. You have to make it. But that's what it looks like. Hmm. You use, okay, so you could use, I'm confused. All right. Uh, pour entire bag of mix in a medium bowl with a fork, mix and mash until evenly moist. Oh, wait. Oh, in the bowl with your choice of ingredients based on the chart above. So you can use, it says liquid, nut butter or ghee or coconut oil or agave or honey or maple. I'm very confused by this whole thing. I'm sick. Yeah, what the hell? That's weird. Okay, so if you can do, you want to do sweet, original, or sweet less. So I guess it's more savory flavored, maybe. You add the different ingredients there. So, what liquid do you use? Water, milk, juice, applesauce, mashed banana, avocado, or coffee is the liquid that, they, that you could coffee. use. Coffee. That's yeah. Money. I'm a fan. So you are doing in this original, not sweetened. Um, you would use a third a cup of water, milk, juice, applesauce, mashed banana, avocado, or coffee. Then you would use a third a cup, no, a quarter cup of nut butter or ghee or coconut oil, and then a quarter cup of agave or honey or maple. I guess the only way to really do this as sweet less, you would use two thirds a cup of water, I guess, probably would be the best, or coffee a half a cup of nut butter and zero of the sweetener. Hmm. I don't know, this is kind of... Sketchy? Yeah. Yeah. It's just, it's a little confusing. It's not very straightforward. I agree. So, okay. So, serving size is three tablespoons, which makes two bites. And there are 12 servings per container. So if you would make the whole package, it'd be 24, um, 24 bites. Uh, just for the dry mix, there's 80 calories, six grams of fat, five carbohydrates with three dietary fiber and seven protein. So the ingredients are pretty simple. Organic shredded coconut, organic Brazil nut powder, organic cocoa powder, organic flaxseed meal, organic vanilla flavor, sea salt, and monk fruit. So my guess is that this is probably very tasty. Because I would make it probably with just two thirds a cup of the the water and then a half a cup of nut butter. Another option would probably be it says agave, honey, or maple. So you could use like a maple syrup. You could use a, a, a sugar free maple syrup. That might be good. You could use all sorts of sugar free stuff. Yeah. Right? And then you just make them into like little balls. So there you go. That is balls. interesting. We're not going to have it tried out before we post this video, but it's definitely something interesting. You want to pull something out next? Uh, I'm going for good to go vanilla almond snack bar. Oh, that sounds good. It does sound good. Okay, a bar uh, is a serving. 160 calories, 13 fat grams, 15 carbs, 7 fiber uh, five erythritol. Five erythritol and six grams of protein. So that's pretty good protein to. Three net carbs. Yeah, three net carbs. All right, and seven, seven fiber. So I mean, if you were having a diet high in fiber, this is low you. Okay, definitely has got that greasy keto bar look. Oh no, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. It looked. Did, at... did we have it? Didn't we try these last month? I don't know. That tastes really good. I don't think we did it. I don't think it was. I really enjoy that. I don't think it was vanilla almond. No, that. but I really enjoy that. What did you think of that? That's not terrible. I really like that a lot. Hmm. It's got like a very dense cake like. Yeah, it's more cakey. Yeah. I think it was. You don't find very often. No. In keto snacks. Right. That's good. 
I'm gonna have to check this out. <sighs> it doesn't have a lot of ingredients. It's almond flour, inulin, erythritol, baking powder, ground chia seeds, natural flavors, sea salt, amaranth flour, rosemary extract, and mi mixed. John ripped the, the paper down there. Oh my. Tocopherols. Oh yeah, you got that. Oh, that's I, I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. All right. I'm going to pull, uh, should I pull the savory or the sweet out? Okay. I'm going to pull this out. This is the oh, Nui no. Cookies peanut butter cookie. What are you so annoying for? Peanut butter, jelly time, peanut butter, jelly time. Peanut butter, jelly, so, peanut butter, jelly. The, we've, we've tried the Nui cookies before, and yeah. they're actually really good. Yeah, we, we got a chocolate chip one in a previous box. Right. The serving size is two cookies. It's 270 calories, 24 fat, 18 carbs, 3 fiber, 11 erythritol. So that's 14, so 4 net carbs. Is that what it says? Yeah, 4 net carbs, 8 protein. Do you want to try this? Uh, sure one. They are, if I remember correctly, they are fairly tasty. Like I said, we tried a chocolate chip one. We got mm -hmm. them before. I'm, I'm going to go back and finish that good to go bar, though. If I remember, they fall apart pretty easily. So let's see how this goes. All right. So it's a full size cookie here. The one on the bottom is kind of crushed. So, yeah. They, 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 they're. They're not totally crumbly, but they definitely come apart pretty easily. It's not as dry. Yeah. It's cooling. It's I got a lot of erythritol in it. It definitely tastes cooling to me. Mm-hmm. It's got a lot of erythritol in it. Okay. What do you think? Eh. I think it, it would have been better before the Good To Go bar. Probably. Good To Go bar is pretty good. Yeah, for that, um, you definitely taste the cooling. When we tried them before, I thought the same thing. You can definitely taste the cooling in the Nui bars because they use a lot of erythritol in them. Um, that's very crumbly. Yeah. That's my biggest problem with it. Like, it's it's it. you put it in your mouth and it just starts to, like, fall apart. So. Yep. All right. All next. Right. Uh, I have... Kosher beef stick from Tomer, Tomer Kosher. Kosher. It's the original smoke flavor added. Um, there is no nutritional information on this at all. It's a beef stick. It's a beef stick. The ingredients are beef, water, seasoning, uh, spices, dehydrated garlic, sodium lactate, modified carrot product, citric acid, liquid smoke, celery juice powder, Stuffed into a beef collagen casing. Are you going to open it or no? No. Not right now. Okay. There is one more thing in here. It is this right here. This is from Sun Biotics. Organic gourmet probiotic snack. It's cheesy almonds. Yeah. A light and crispy super snack. Mm -hmm. Soaked and sprouted probiotic enhanced mineral infused. Yes. What it looks like. Don't yes. know that it's going to focus, but... Uh, 1.5 servings per container, 28 grams. So an ounce basically is uh, one serving. 180 calories, 13 grams of fat, seven carbohydrates, three fiber, so four net carbs. So it's like, what, six for the bang? And six protein. And the ingredients are organic sprouted raw almonds, nutritional yeast, sea salt, probiotic blend of L. acidophilus, B. blidium, B. lactis, and B. longum. Mm hmm do you want to try them? Sure. Okay. What's that face? They don't really have much of a smell, which I was expecting something of a smell. Mm. So, oh, you're eating both. So ones? yeah, so they are cheesy. Literally, if you've ever had nutritional yeast, yeah. they literally just look like almonds dusted with nutritional yeast. What do you think? They they're not cheesy. I don't taste they them. taste like nutritional yeast. If you um um no yeah. nutritional yeast tastes better. I think you're giving nutritional yeast a bad name. 
My biggest problem with these is that I'm so used to having salted almonds. Yeah. That not having any salt or not much salt. Did it have any salt? No. Yeah, sea salt. It does not have a lot of salt in them. So mm. I I associate almonds with salt and Yeah. Um they, they, this just doesn't have enough salt for me. No. I don't know what that says about me, but it doesn't have enough salt for me, so Yeah, they're salty. Anyway. All right, so we got the almonds. We got the almonds. The Nui cookie. The empty now Virgil's zero sugar vanilla cream, mm -hmm. which I thought was pretty good. The beef stick. The beef stick. The energy bite mix. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The shake. The element. Um, electrolytes. Electrolytes. Yes, thank you. The curly girls candy. The uh, super fat pouch of um, butter. Cacao coconut butter, the good to go bar, and the Cuevos egg whites. There you go. What were your favorites? Super fat, the the, uh, the soda. Virgil. I thought the soda was pretty good. Mm -hmm. And um, some of the stuff we couldn't try. Yeah, I'm not so. really, I mean, although I like the good to go bar, it's not like, to me, it's still just a bar. It's still, I mean, like, I... These bars don't really rock my world. Yeah. You know what I mean? I like this. I know you do. I, uh, my, the good to go and the super fat were my two favorites. I would consider buying some of the super fat. Yes. And I'm definitely going to be looking into the good to go bar. Super fats. Yeah. I'm there with you on the super fat. Uh, the good to go. Whatever. Um, and we already get some Virgils every once in a while. You can get Virgils in at Target. Yeah. We've actually bought some at Target. Yeah. So. Not something that I'm like gonna die for. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, I I definitely like the good to go. Oh. And the super fat. I'm gonna check these out too. Um. Yeah. That is our keto box. Yep. I think it was pretty good. Yeah. I I'm definitely happy that I found this good, the good to go bar because I'm definitely gonna be looking into buying some of these. There you go. All right. Uh, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to see our videos as they come out or you want to support the channel subscribe mm -hmm. uh if you share it yeah share it sorry mm -hmm. thank you if you have a comment leave a comment down below have you tried any of these yeah uh do you like virgils uh don't forget to ring that bell yeah uh to get notified as soon as our videos come out and thank you for watching on receipt. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.